your side. They were severely burned uh, from the head top all the way down to their feet. A terrifying day for a Bradenton family when their house explodes with a father and son inside. The father and son both suffering horrific burns. Good evening. I'm Jennifer Lee. And I'm Evan Donovan. A daughter rushed back home to discover their home in pieces after a gas leak that began underground hours earlier. Eight on your side's Melanie Michael is live at the home in Bradenton. It's at the corner of 8th Street West and 30th Avenue West tonight. Good evening, Mel. Good evening to you both. I got to tell you, when we heard the details of what took place in this house, we were speechless. I want to show you what the house looks like tonight. There is literally nothing left. And if you take a closer look, you can see some Christmas decorations in the front yard. That family suffering tonight, wondering how did this happen and will the father and son survive? It was a nightmare waiting to happen, and no one saw it coming. An explosion in the middle of the day in a house with a family inside. A father and son were in this home when it exploded, burned from head to toe. All this, according to close friends. A moment that the mother witnessed while she was standing in the front yard. Images she'll never forget. She said that their hair wasn't, was missing. Um, it was just their whole face was, uh, probably was a uh, third degree burn, most likely. Uh, they haven't heard from the hospital since, and uh, they're just in critical condition right now. Mark Torado knows this family well. He is dating their daughter, who called him at work when the explosion happened. Yeah, she, she was devastated, crying and stuff, and I couldn't believe it myself because usually, I, you know, you don't see something like that happen nowadays. You, you know, it's just usually in the movies and stuff. I mean, they're critical right now, and so far they don't have any updates. Hospital want to update them or anything. So me and him were worried. The father and son were rushed to Blake Hospital for treatment. And the family is waiting for answers. How do you feel tonight knowing that you could have been in that house? Uh, I'm just like, I'm grateful that I'm, I'm alive right now because you never know what could happen at any moment. You know, you know, tomorrow's not promised, and uh, I'm just grateful that I'm living right here, right now. Sobering images to take a look at tonight. We are awaiting word on that father and son. Meanwhile, there are crews out here for blocks. It is a full scale operation at this hour. They have been there since noon and they will continue to be there throughout the night, ensuring the safety of folks in that neighborhood, getting this gas leak under control. We are live tonight in Bradenton. I'm Melanie Michael. Eight on your side.